What's up, everybody? It's your boy Brandon Blakey, aka Brandon Lee TV. Got my guy Keyshawn Silver, aka Big Country, in the building. Now, I know y'all seen him putting that work on the gridiron. Now, you out here putting some work in. Just made the announcement, man, you're going to be playing hoops as well as playing football at Carolina. Um, what led to the decision and what inspired your love for hoops, man? Um, I, grew up, I grew up a basketball player. I've been hooping my whole life. Um, I really just started playing football like eighth grade, so. That's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, I know like, this is the second time we've done this. You ain't yeah. said it the first time. That's crazy. Yeah. So how have you progressed so fast? Well, that's actually kind of scary. Um, <laughs> like, <laughs> that's kind of scary, yeah, and grinding. So, oh, no. like, I know you try to play with physicality on both ends, sitting down there, giving a little body down there on the post. Um, what 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 brings that out of you? And also, how to, what skills, I guess, translate on the football field as far as, like, footwork and all that? What do you bring to the basketball court, too? Uh, aggression. When you get in triple team by like three different people, maybe a four person, it just makes you easy. You just you got pass on so you can grab it. You can grab and fight. Uh, basketball, you know, it's like um, shoot. When you box out one person, hey, that's life. You know, you get triple team, double team as a DN, and then you go against good people like six, five, three hundred. Yeah, people, like, big boy. So I'm like grown man. So. So, as far as the competition, what do you think it's been like out here so far? Is it what you expected? And is it helping you stay in shape? I know since y'all aren't really getting in that work that y'all usually do during football workouts right now. I mean, it's, it's a good competition. I want to play on a higher level, especially if I go to college. I want to go against people that's taller than me. You know, I want to show people that I can really play against six, 11 people. You know, yeah. even, even though they're young, but they still have to go to their collegiate level to play. Yeah. So, yeah. if I go against a six, 11 person now, it's going to be easier in the future, I expect. How you, how would you describe your game on the court for people that haven't seen you? Um, I love defense, so I'm like a Dennis Rodman. But if you know offense, I can switch it up. You know, Carl Malone, Le Shaggish. You know, I'm just a freakish player, so you know it's it's something that I. Hey, that's some names out there, no cap. So I know, man, you've accomplished a lot on the football field. Um, what goes into that as far as becoming a five star? Is that something that you set out personally to do? And also, um, you know, how do you stay humble and knowing that? people coming for you being the number one guy here in the North Carolina? Um, I mean, in a million years, I never expect where I be now. Um, I'm, from, I'm from Howard Street, that's nothing. Like, it's, it's, it's rare you come from Rocky Mountain, make it out. I mean, it's like a couple people, but, you know, stay humble, man. You just gotta look at your background. Like, like my motivation is to my old house. Like, I look at him like, man, I can't, can't stay there forever. Like, yeah. like, my old house, man, that jumped so bad, bro. And like that right there just motivate me every day every time I see it roll past it. It so. seems like man, y'all guys from ENC is really just built different, man. Like what goes into that? I feel like every every athlete I meet or interview from down there, man, it's just a dog, just hard nose, ready to work, just ready to get it. All the time. We just we different. Everybody in North Carolina different. All day, every day. So what are you looking forward to? What sold you on North Carolina being, especially you being the biggest recruit? I follow you on Twitter, we spoke, man. You always just Recruiting guys, trying to get guys to stay home, man. Everybody, I know they always join you up, loving it. Yeah. Tar Heel Nation always showing you love, yeah. man. Oh, um, yeah, shout, shout out. out. Shout <laughs> each other. How, how, how does that feel, man? And how would you express that to other players that may be considering UNC and what sold you on? The realest love out here. I mean, every school show love, but it's like Toronto show a different value of love, like. It's not, it's not the higher things, oh, you the top player in the country. It's about the little things. How's the family? You do your work today, you eat, you work out. It's just the little things that coaches, you know, could throw at them. And Kalana showed a lot of them. How has Matt Brown helped to restore, like, the excitement around? Because it was like two years ago before Matt came, Carolina wasn't getting guys like you. Yeah. So, like, how, how do you think he's established this excitement and you helped establish this excitement? And y'all got guys really hyped for basketball, or football, excuse me, mm -hmm. coming into the future. Well, uh, I feel like Matt Brown is a, a successful person, the most successful person I've ever been around. He's the most humble coach I've ever been around. You know, we love you to death like you his own son, even though we're not the same blood. Yep. Show a lot of love, and it's just like the first time I met him, it was like, man, I just got to be here with him. Okay, he's going to put me on the right path. So. Now, I know you're big time recruiting other guys. How important is that? Um, you trying to reel these guys in. What can we expect from the 2021 class? Oh, uh, and that is. When we enroll, we get in that. Man. All right, before we let you go, man, I know you guys are big in the music, a lot of stuff dropping. You was telling me about a couple rappers last time. Um, let us know, man, who you listening to and getting hyped to before the games, man. 
Pops from up for sure. RIP. But you know, that tell me Cinco though. Hey. Different. Hey. <laughs> Different. Facts. Oh, yeah. Facts, man. I definitely appreciate you going on again. Def got the audio this time. Um, let them know where to find you on social media, man, uh, so they can follow your journey. Uh, well, my name is Keyshawn Silver at KB Country. You can find me on Instagram at Keyshawn uh, dot underscore K E E S H A W N dot underscore. Um, my Twitter is underscore Jumpman74. Yeah, my man's still trying to get the 10K, so help, help my guy.